Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Later on today, we are expecting to see Mozilla Firefox version 109 roll out. Currently, the latest release is version 108. And then in February, we are expecting to see version 110 be released to the stable channel of Firefox. And when it comes to using the browser on Windows, with version 110 of Firefox rolling out in February uh, next month, and we are expecting to see GPU sandboxing available now in the browser being used on Windows operating systems. Now, just to do a quick recap in case you are unaware what sandboxing is and what it does. Basically, a sandbox isolates um, malware and exploited malware. Um, it keeps it in the sandbox um, and it prevents it from directly attacking um, other processes on your uh, device, as an example. And what, as mentioned, it keeps that um, malware in the uh, sandbox and basically prevents it from running attacks um, in other areas of your system. So that's just a very brief overview as to what a sandbox is, in case you are unaware. Now, um, the stable version of Mozilla Firefox does already support a couple of different sandboxes. And to get to those, we just head to the menu, click on Help, navigate to more troubleshooting information, and and this is the page that contains technical information that might be useful when you are trying to solve a problem, as many of you may know. And to get to the different sandboxes, we just go right down to the bottom and then just scroll up slightly. And here we get um, different sandboxes currently available, which are content process uh, sandbox level, effective content process sandbox level, and Win32K lockdown state for content process. And then here currently you can see GPU process sandbox level. And as mentioned, this is going to be rolling out uh, in version 110, which currently is disabled. That's why it's got a zero as the value. And um, when that value changes to one in version 110 of the Firefox web browser rolling out in February 2023, then that means that GPU sandboxing will be available in the browser um, for Windows users of Mozilla Firefox. Now, currently, um, the GPU sandboxing is available uh, in the nightly developer and beta versions of um, uh, Firefox. And then, as mentioned, when version 110 does roll out uh, next month in February, it uh, uh, will then be enabled, um, according to reports, by default in the stable version. So um, it's just going to be another security aspect of the browser. Um, where um, in version 110, that will be the first stable version um, of uh, Firefox for, for desktop uh, to support um, GPU sandboxing. And that will then be a default feature that will be made available in Mozilla Firefox version 110. So I just wanted to let you know, if you are using the browser, uh, it'll just be another enhanced um, aspect when it comes to security. And as mentioned, uh, in a short while, um, later today, we are actually expecting to see version 109 roll out. And then I will obviously post on that when that does become available. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.